Dun 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 dun. Wow, this music really is like full on, isn't it? Huh, cool. Uh, yeah, hello everyone. Welcome back to some Dragon Quest IV. We have reached the point in the game where I think I want to do a bit more exploring of the world because there's quite a few regions, as you can see, on the world map that we've we've not ventured into yet. So I want to check those out. I don't know what's going to happen, uh, but that's good. That's exciting. I I love. The unknown in these sorts of games, even though uh, I have been told of a few locations I may want to uh, check out, specifically where we can hand in the mini medals, the many, many mini medals that we've found, so which I believe is the northeastern area. So we'll check that out. But first, but first, I was told in a comment that I may have forgotten something at the Palais de Lyon, so we're gonna zoom back the just briefly and see if uh, we have forgot to do something. Uh, maybe rescuing the king from from the dungeon. Uh, so we're gonna go back in here and see if I see if I can find the dungeon for one thing. I assume it's gonna be down somewhere. I forget though. I maybe not. Maybe it's upstairs. I mean, we did have a chat with a few of these people, didn't we? But... I forget where the goddamn dungeon is. It's definitely not out there. I probably should have looked this up. I probably should have looked this up. But oh well. Uh, is it... Oh, hang on. Is it not in the secret passage? Can we even go in there anymore? Yeah, we can. Let's go back in here... Uh, oh, this was... No, this was just the throne room, wasn't it? There's nothing else to do here. I mean, everyone's back to normal, it seems. Which is good. Which is good. But where the hell is the dungeon? Unless I'm in the wrong place. I could be in the wrong place. I could have misread the comment or misremembered the comment. Um... Um... Oh, hang on. Was the... Hang... No, was the dungeon over here? Oh, maybe this is it. Yes, maybe. Is that the kid? Was that the king? Dude, you're not gonna w really. How do I get back in there? I th I didn't realize he was. How did I get back in there? Oh my god, this is such a good start to a video, isn't it? I have no clue what I'm doing. Um, I don't remember. I don't remember. I'm so sorry. How do you get in there? It was... I don't... I don't know. Didn't I get put in there? Like, I don't... Bloody... Yeah, when I... When I got beaten, wasn't I put in that cell automatically? I forget how you get out. Oh, uh, you know what? I'll, I'll be right back, because I just don't freaking know. Okay, um... I'm gonna be honest, I really don't know what to do with, um... With this, uh, the comment just said you forgot to free the king from the Palais de Leon, and I mean that's the only dude I can see in a cell. But I don't know how to get back to his cell because this dude seems to be sleeping like day and night. So I don't know. I is it is it necessary? I I don't. It doesn't seem to be. But uh, we're just, we're gonna forget about this for now. I'm sure you guys will let me know if if I've mis like read something or misunderstood. But we are going to go off exploring now. Um, so I suppose we want to maybe zoom somewhere a little bit closer to where. We in fact, in fact, there's an island like right in the middle, isn't there? Also, I think there's one we haven't been to to the north. You know what? Let's hop on our boat. Let's hop on our boat and just go sailing. Let's just make sure we. Have a look around everywhere. Uh, there doesn't seem to be anything there of note. Okay, fair enough. Let's check out this island in the middle. And yes, we're gonna be... Oh god! More... Oh, these are Tuskateers! These are different from the Malruses we fought before. And then we still got uh, Barracuda, okay. Uh, yeah. We're gonna be fighting a lot of things on the ocean, I'm guessing, in these... Uh... 
these videos or this this session. But that's okay. That's okay. I'm sure we can we can tackle them. He's gonna crackle on those two. Kirill, try and whack the Barracuda, please. Ooh, those things are pretty tough. Oh, no. See what I mean? The whack spell is so good in this game. Maybe I'm just getting really lucky, but it seems to be, like, really, really effective. So, uh, so yeah. Let's see what this, uh... Ah, now this might be inaccessible. Which reminds me, I need to go back to that island in the top left of the map, because apparently you can land there, but this looks... this looks like a no-go to me. Now, as, as far as the story goes, I think what we need to do... we got that flute of Revelation last time, we saw the dream with, um, with Saro and the woman in the tower, that's where we need to go to play the flute. I don't know exactly where it is, but I'm sure we'll find it eventually. But I just, I just really want to do some exploring. Uh, for one thing, I really want to know if we can progress that side quest with the uh, with the liquid metal sword. I really don't know. All I know is we need to find a waterfall of some description. But but hey, that's that's what's so good about these games, especially playing them for the first time. Just just the like the you know <laughs> the exploration and the discovery. I also just bit my lip, and it's really sore. Ow. Ugh. That sea looks pretty rough, by the way. Not sure I'd be too comfortable on that. Not that I get seasick, I'm just terrified of the sea. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, so this bottom continent, on first inspection, looks to be completely surrounded by mountains. Can we even make land on this? Ooh. Yes, we can. Oh, God. Oh! Okay, um, we seem... this is cool. Oh, wow. Where the hell is this? It, well, it's nighttime, so it doesn't seem to be anyone around, but... Whoa. Whoa, ho, ho. New place, guys. Yeah, everyone's asleep. Apart from this guy. The bloke on the opposite bank is a real dag. He's trying to build one of them flying machines. Oh. Dude, are we going to get a flying machine in this game? I reckon he's a bit of a whacker. You mean... What do you mean by that? Hmm? What do you mean by that? I mean, my, my mind instantly just goes to, you know, beating the old, uh... Twig and berries, but I, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, uh, not that mine's a twig and berries, mine's a stump and coconuts. No, I... what am I even saying? Ooh, shiny. Yeah, see the life. And a cat. And graves. Doesn't seem to be anything of note. Is there going to be anything of note on any of these graves? I will check them all anyway. Uh, also, thank you for telling me about that whole town quest that I thought was just going to be online only. It seems to be, you can still progress that, but it's uh, dependent on story progress, so we'll go back there intermittently, maybe, and check it out. What is down here? What even is this place? Oh, hello. This is a nice little secluded island you've got. Oh, dude! Mini metal! Yeah, the more we can get of those before we go see the mini metal dude, obviously the better. Back in the old days, people used to fly about in the sky in funny contraptions they built. But that all ended when the Lord of the Underworld went and made off with the basic ingredient, if you like. I reckon it probably ended up being sealed away with him, you know. Ooh, Interesting. I'm very excited about this. I would very much like a flying machine. That would make getting around even, even easier than a boat. And some of these, uh, well, that island in the middle of the world might be accessible only, only by flying. So, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna make it daytime. We're gonna make it daytime because I want to see what they have in this shop. 
Nothing happened? Oh, dude, can we not use it here? Seriously? Is it only on the world map? Probably is, isn't it? Let's see what's on the other side. Can we even... Oh, yeah, that's nice. I thought we might need, a like, a proper... proper jetty, but no, it's fine. We definitely do want to check this place out. During the daytime, though, and I am getting some slowdown. The moonwalk bulb! What do you fucking do? In fact, we can just stay at the inn. Ooh, what's this? <laughs> Who are you guys? The old man's always complaining he's too tired for chit-chat. He won't talk, talk to me at all, the mongrel. That's not very nice. Stop being so antisocial, you bastard. I'm a battler through and through, me. I work hard all day long, you know. The last thing I want to hear when I get home is some crazy yabber about the Colossus statue taking a walk. Colossus statue, you say? Ah. I have to remember that. Ooh, a gold bracer. Now, that's got to be... That's got to be the candidate. Well, it easily is the candidate for best item we found in a wardrobe so far. Let's make sure it is actually decent, though. Who wants to equip that, I wonder? Mm, is it in the bag? Did I put it in the bag? Yes. Gold Bracer, transfer. Uh, what does it do, by the way? Is it just for defense? Yeah. Who wants that? Mm. Well, I don't know. I don't know, really. I didn't even... I didn't even know there were accessories in this game. Hang on a minute. I've just realized, is this the first one we've found? Are accessories the thing? Let's give it to Boya. In fact, we'll take away the Iron Helmet. Equip this now? Yeah, is it going to replace any of our equipment? No! No, it doesn't! Oh, that's cool! Okay, maybe we just haven't found accessories then. That's kind of crazy. I'm sure you guys will correct me if I'm wrong, but that seems like... Uh... Like the first one we've come across. Cool, okay. Well, it's definitely worth checking this place out. Let's rest at the inn in a second. Let's check out this house. Oh, hello. Am I interrupting something? It says in the old books that the thing that made the flying machines work was in some kind of hard canister. I wonder if that larrikin really can make a flying machine? Is this... is this the dude? I reckon it'd fly if I could find a gas that's lighter than air. That'd be bonza! It's gonna be a hot air balloon, isn't it? It's gonna be a hot air balloon. I think? Mage looks at the bookshelves. Nothing of interest. Another mini medal, yes! Can't wait to hand those in and see what we can get. <laughs> I think we'll definitely head over to where this mini metal dude apparently is. But let's uh, let's rest at the inn. No, don't get on the boat. What are you doing? I said rest at the inn. Oh. Oh. Oh, hello. Did I interrupt something? <laughs> Am I always interrupting something in this place? I, uh, yeah. 80 gold? Okay. Yeah, I mean, I would like to save up for those amazing armors we saw in the shop in Endor, but I, I don't know. I mean, that was ridiculously expensive. Uh, I trust the address. Yada, yada, yada. Yes, yes, yes. <clears throat> so, I mean, one way we could make money, apparently, is the casino. Winning some prizes, selling them. I don't know. I really don't know if that's going to be uh, something I'm going to do. Hooly dooly! I could barely believe my eyes, you know. Hardly believe them. There's a humongo statue to the south of this river. And Struth, I swear I saw it go walk about. Fair, fair dick. Yeah, I, I, uh... I know I've come across this particular uh, dialect in a Dragon Quest game before. I believe... Wasn't it, um, in Dragon Quest VIII? I, this is the one that I'm thinking of. I'm sure it's been in other Dragon Quest games as well. But wasn't it the, um... The guy with the saber cats? I, I don't... It's been so long since I played that game. 
Right, what armor do you have? It probably isn't going to be as good as the Endor armor, but... Wait a goddamn minute. Dragon Mail? Hey, and that's pretty cheap, too. Con well, comparatively. Look at that dragon shield, man. Ah, yes, and of course it protects from fire and ice-based attacks. I want one. I want one. We can't afford one, but again, I reckon I'm going to be coming back here, perhaps, and making some purchases. I could sell some stuff. I have a lot of, sh of shit I could sell. But... I don't know if I'm going to make enough money to, to buy that. How much can I sell horse manure for? One, one gold. Who would actually buy horse... I mean, I suppose it is useful fertilizer, but still. Um, yeah, I could sell I could sell a couple of these Cortru swords. I don't think we're going to need them on anyone else now. Because I believe we have all of our party members. So, maybe I should sell them. Which would get us, you know... Enough for a dragon shield. I could do that. I could totally do that. Because because Ragnar's already got one. I've already got one. And Tornico's already got one. So yeah, I'm going to sell these. I'm going to sell them. Yes, please. Thank you. I'm going to buy a dragon shield. I, I think that would be... That would be pretty sweet. That'd be pretty sweet. I mean, I could get the mail as well. Or, or the mail. Uh, now, the Dragon Shield's gonna give us more of an increase. Way more of an increase in defense. So, I'm gonna do it. There we go. Dragon Shield is mine. Mage, you are going to equip that straight away, my son. Um, fine, reorganize my items. I don't care. Would you like to equip it now? Yes. Cool. Right, so... We'll come back here when we have a bit more money. Uh, let's head over to the weapon shop. See what they've got. How do I freaking land my boat? There we go. <laughs> let's see what they have in the weapon shop. Uh, let's see. Ooh, Battle Axe. Again, not really interested in that. That's not much of an increase. Dream Blade. May send its target to sleep from time to time. Very nice, but... The Dragon's Bane. Holy shit. Holy shit. That... That's pretty freaking good. Increased damage on dragons, of course. I don't know how many dragons we're going to be fighting, but um, look at that attack increase. I mean, I don't know how good the liquid metal sword's going to be. I assume better than this, but for, I mean, that's only 15,000. That's not actually that dear compared, you know, just, just looking at the stats. That's pretty good. So again, I will be returning here. Uh, even the Dream Blade would be a good purchase, I think. Especially if it will put things to sleep. I don't know how often that will work, but that's pretty good. So, but I think I'd rather save for the Dragon's Bane, if anything. Ooh, yeah. Yeah, I like this place. We'll be back here. I don't know what, I don't know what the hell the name of it is, though. Can I even zoom back here, I wonder? Um, let's, let's leave. Okay, yeah. I wonder if there's any other places on this continent. Oh, there's a shrine. How do I get to that? Let's see, can I zoom? Is it, is it, oh, it must be Riverton? Yeah, that must be Riverton then. Let's just test this, just so we, we know. Oh! Oh, I wonder if I could have kept on sailing through it to get to this. Ah, I bet you could. Yeah, probably, but let's check this shrine out then. I have no idea how tough the enemies are going to be. Oh, it's a teleporter. Where's this going to take me? 
Hopefully we can come back. Where's this? Oh, yeah. We, we need the ultimate key for this. Okay. So that's of no use to us right now. So... I wonder what sort of enemies we can run into down here, and is there anything else? Oh! I think we've just seen that Colossus. Whoa! Rhinocerax! <laughs> Three of them. Okay, let's, uh, let's see how tough they are. Let's see if I can reduce the defense. They look like they're going to be pretty tanky. Oh, yes. Yes. Oh, they're attacking twice. And they know Kasap as well. And they know Buff. Whoa, did you see that defense increase? Holy crap. Yeah, these guys get like two turns and they have all the buffs and debuffs. I'm going to try and put them to sleep. Uh, I need to oomph Elena, I think. Uh, although they might be weak to magic. Let's try that, actually. Let's go for a, a crackle. Kyriel, um... Kabuffus. Because we've lost some defense. Wow! We did no damage to that guy. Oh my lord. We are gonna... T if they have physically attacked... Yeah, they're still pretty susceptible to magic. Okay. If they hit us, we we are gonna take all the damage. So let's uh, let's try and prevent that, please. Sears or um yeah, let's go for a Sears. Elena, you can't really do anything else. Another crackle that should kill them. Curial, go for a whack. Oh, she still did good damage to that one. Okay, cool. Yes! Nice. Alright, that could have been... If they had actually physically attacked us, I reckon that might have been the end of some of our characters. 735 XP. Yeah, these enemies are going to be pretty tough around these parts. And I see what is probably that Colossus statue they mentioned. However, I can't get to it. So I'm going to head back to the boats. And fight some mini-demons. which are not anything to be worried about at all. <laughs> Tell you what, for how easy it was to kill them, that was actually pretty good XP. Right, so this is Riverton. Uh, we could... Oh. Oh, that's how we get to it. I'm actually really nervous to approach that, because... I, mm, I think we'll come back here. We'll come back here. I want to go see the Mini Metal dude, anyway and explore the uh, the top right of the map, so... Yeah, this this is Riverton. So we can just sail on through. Maybe I should talk to the nun. People reckon there's a monster castle somewhere in the Ostro Outback. No one's been enough of a g gala to go and find out if that's true or not, though. <laughs> a, a monster castle? Ugh. Maybe one day we'll check it out. But we shall bid farewell to Riverton. That's a nice place. Um, so let's cut through. I mean, we probably could zoom to... So you know what, actually? I'm going to zoom to... Burland. Yes. I think that was probably the most northern... Oh, it was here? Oh. Um, this was not a good choice of zoom location. Where's my boat, anyway? Oh, there it is. Actually, no, that's okay. Let's go along this river. Ah, ah, what's... Wait a minute. 
Hmm. Oh, a Picuda and some incin incinerators. Oh my god. Incinerators. <laughs> Let's see how tough these are. Um, actually, mate, you focus on the on the on the fishy. Well, they're all they're all technically fish, but you know what I mean. Elena as well, and Crackle and a whack. Okay, they're hitting pretty decent. Yeah, what goes this way? Mage needs a heal. But it can wait. 820 XP? Bloody hell. Bloody hell. Elena, level 25. Her strength and agility increases are kind of... Kind of terrifying. Boy, level 24, sweet. Are you going to learn any new spells today, old chum? No. But that's okay. Where is this? Yeah, this is this is a part of the continent we've not been to. Da, 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 da. Whoa! Warus. <laughs> And, oh my god, that might be my favorite enemy design. With the Grim Riders. They look awesome. I'm also terrified. Mage, you, you really need to heal, but we'll try and get rid of one of these guys. Boya, uh... Kasap? Curial, mid-heal, please. That Warus, holy crap. Well, luckily he's gone. Mage has got over 200 HP now, by the way. That's rather nice. Oh no, they can call for backup. No! That's alright, it's only a skeleton soldier. Nothing to worry about. Sod off. Stop calling for backup, goddammit. Right, let's yeah, let's get rid of you before you call any more. How much HP do they have? Yeah, I tell you what, guys, I'm I'm feeling pretty good today. I've woken up and uh my well, my mouth is uh, is no longer sore or hurting in any way, so I think I'm I'm well on the road to recovery now. It's healing quite nicely. Ragnar gets a level, and Tornico gets a level. Not that that's that important to us. Where is this leading? Where is this? Where is this? <laughs> oh my god. Um I don't seem it looks like a dead end. Okay. Well that was fun, I guess. What's the point of being here? There must be something we can do there at some point in the game. I don't know whether we have what we need. Yeah, you must come back here at some point. Okay, we'll we'll come back. We'll keep on exploring. That's very suspicious, though. Hmm. Anyway, I want to zoom somewhere that gives us access to the northern parts, so we don't have to sail all the way around the continent to get to where we want to go. So I need to remember. Um, Strathbale? Is that closer to the north? <laughs> I mean, this is where we could have that dream again if we wanted to. Ah, yeah, this is perfect. This is perfect. Cool. 
Um, yeah, we could we could watch that dream again, apparently, to see where we need to use the flutes. But we're going to ignore that for now. We're going to ignore the story for now, pretty much. What's over this way? Anything of interest? Oh, there's a cave. I think someone in the comments actually mentioned this cave. Ooh, a pteranodon. I'm gonna sneeze. Ugh. Sorry about that. Oh god, he knows whack. Yeah, kill him quick. This is Snake, telling you to subscribe to Mage Masher 22 on YouTube and Twitch. Snake out.